Big Stripe D here with a much deserved update for the Noob to Pro series, a free to play account where we started from day one and we are currently on day 36, trying to get the Abita missions done as quickly or efficiently as possible. Welcome if it's the first time you're seeing one of these videos. Now I've not posted a while, this is the holiday times and it's been kind of busy. Not busy at home or with family. I'm been at work the entire time and yes i'll be working all christmas hopefully you are all on your holidays and you're enjoying your time and the first update i wanted to share today the most important one is the 2x ancient events that is coming up this friday and saturday it is a big deal on this channel shard pool videos are what i live for especially ancient shard pool videos because it gives me an opportunity to guarantee me a new legendary champion for my main account I don't know about our luck for this account because we currently have sitting here only 32 ancient shards. Yes, we will be pulling all our ancient shards. Imagine a free to play account getting 32 ancient shards because I've been saving it for 36 days, 32. It's We've already pulled some a while ago but we'll be pulling all this on Friday. Yes, there are two events that are coming up. If I pull up the message right here, the 2x starts. 8 a.m utc that is 9 a.m my time utc plus one so that's on december 24th which is tomorrow if you're watching this video and then when the 2x ancient starts that friday it starts with a 10x on bad el kazar from ancient shards so the 10x is for ancient shards so don't think you pull secrets and expect the 10x to be on the secret because i have actually thought of it i'm like this is a good opportunity for me to get a bad el kazar should i pull secret shards also on this day so that i'll get a guarantee me a bad l but no the 10x only applies to ancient shards so this is kind of sad because i would have pulled my seven or nine secrets that i have on the account but we will save our secrets because we do have two on this account chilling here so we will not need to pull these two secrets because it doesn't guarantee us any 2x or 10x on the secrets so i just thought i clarified that because a lot of people thinking since it's a 10x it should apply to not just ancient shard it also applies to secret shard but no badel is from 10x for ancient shards get that right and the other champion that people are talking about with her she's meh all we know in the game is because Badel has served his time, he has proven his worth, he has sh showed up in a lot of content, but she is currently, is currently getting judged against him because she's kind of new and she does similar but she doesn't do as much damage in terms of poison that he does or she doesn't increase your um, allies damage like he does. So it's not a fair comparison by no means. They are both legendary champions, yes, but everybody will be going for a battle except you already have him and then you might need to you know go for a second champion which is with her so she has a good design and all that but we don't want it especially those who are looking for a battle to increase their damage in general content so that's a champion i'm looking forward to getting to add to my account is one of those ones that if you don't have him yet like a prince kaima it seems like your dungeon runs are not yet complete you're not yet doing speed runs if you don't have a bad elf prince kaima sia and all those big names everybody should have them by now if you've been playing for a year or, or more so that's why i'm really looking forward to getting him from my how many shots do i have on the main account 63 on the main account and 32 on this account so about a hundred about a hundred ancient shards will be pulled tomorrow so that's the big update i wanted to provide first of all so you don't miss out on that video when it will be dropping tomorrow morning the first thing i do is to pull it because i'm waiting for this 2x so that's about that the noob to pro will be getting some new champions and i've been waiting i've been farming we're currently sitting on about five no four four five star food right now one two three four so we're not crying trying to level up anybody right now to 60 because we are waiting for these 2x ancients to see if we can pull anything worthy of 16 so that's why i'm currently waiting there's a champion training going on and we're just leveling up food and also there's a dragon tournament or is it an event it's a tournament right going on but it's not just about the tournament it's about the super rates that is on for the dragon in our last video we told you that we could beat 
um dragon 16 now and i've been saying i will spend all my energy that i get in the game on dragon 16 to make sure we have enough gear to progress in other content so we've been doing just that and super rate came along and made it possible for us to farm for twice the energy for twice the gear so it's kind of risky because if it fails you lose the gear you lose that 28 um, energy and you don't get any gear but i've been running it successfully maybe at a 98 percent success rate which is useful for me and i've been getting some not so good gear so far i've not seen anything worthy of leveling up to 16 that i want to replace with any of the existing gear that i do have so it's not been a fun experience in this dragon 16. i do get five star yes i do get six stars but they don't give me speed substat or crit rate or those good substats or they're not even on the right set that you need maybe in sleep um set or something a weird strange set so that's what this account have been up to dragon farming and campaign leveling up of those five star champions you just saw those are the only two things i've been engaged in why did I decide to focus on all these these two things on the account is because my main account is currently doing a fusion. Yes, this is not a fusion update video, but I wanted to mention that in tomorrow's video, I'll be showing you how far I've gone in that fusion. This champion or this account has actually, you know, picked up a, one of the fusion rare. We are not even trying to attempt to go for the fusion rares in this account or the epics, no, because we are not yet in that um, stage. We did pick up an ordinator. I shared it in the last video. And... Going by this dragon tournament, I think I'm going to pick up the other fusion champion. What's her name now? The Mi Miss Miss Misericord. Yeah. So we'll be picking up this one from the dragon farming that we are currently doing because we're close to that milestone. So I'll have two of the rares. But the main rare that I said in the previous video, it seems like this one was the most useful. Castigator. It seems like we're not going to get a castigator. But hey, the fusion is still going on. Maybe an event will come up where we need to pick that one up and we'll do so. So I have, I'm going to get two out of four rares. I don't think that will be enough resources for me to get four out of them to get one of the epics. But that's not the goal. I'm focusing on the fusion on my main account. That's what the Noob to Pro series has been up to. Farming campaign. Why also farming the dragon? I'm considering using my energy i mean my gems to farm the dragon at 16. we did win cvc we've picked up the rewards and i've used all the rewards over here for farming i've not picked up the ring yet let's see which it's a shadow king ring i don't have any shadow king faction you know how hard it is for us to get um accessories in the early game and they keep giving me strange accessories that i do not have we've not taken ourselves into the dragon no into the spider yet to farm anything because a mission has not requested us to while i'm giving up the updates let's take a look at the habitat missions where we are we are still at chapter i mean part three of seven 196 and this mission says win five superior magic potions from stage 13 of the magic keep so currently that keep is not open so once it's open we'll go in there and do it i have completed recently missions that require me to farm the dragon 13 for 15 it didn't say five 15 dragon artifacts 15 ice golem artifacts i'm happy the next one will probably tell us to go farm 15 fire knight artifacts so i'm not looking forward to that one where is it it doesn't see anything about 15 fire knight artifacts though because they know the fire knight is extremely difficult see it says 10 win 10 five star artifact from stage 10 so i think i don't know who can beat fire knight 10 yet but hey uh by the time i finish all these missions we'll have enough resources to take good champions in there that will do that mission for the fire knight so that's the next one i'm looking forward to the habitat missions are progressing well well enough the question i wanted to ask you guys now in the next thing is who would you be going for in this 2x ancient are you looking forward to bad l or do you already have him and you're going for with her speaking of bad l there's a new event that is currently going on you might not have noticed it but yet they did pop out an avatar because they know most people will not read the news so there's a red notice right there for your avatar that is telling you there's a new one bad l kazaa 
avatar that you can win if you're creative creative enough of course so it's not just for free it's not from missions it's not from you have to get this creative avatar by completing a challenge a fan art contest is currently going on so if you could create a fan art related to Ray Shadow Legends post it on your Twitter Instagram and Facebook and all that and using the hashtag what's the hashtag now where is the hashtag red fan art so it has it doesn't have to be about a particular thing it can be anything related to raid as long as it's your original work it doesn't have to be a drawing or painting it could be a sculpture it could be a comic a cosplay a song a music video and all that anything you can come up with related to raid and use the raid fan art hashtag to post it you stand a chance of getting the badel kazaa um what do you call it now display picture in your game the avatar in your game so this might be a very special one for the creative ones out there i know i will not be participating since we're talking about battle i just decided to mention it because this red dot has been chilling there showing a lot of people who don't know why it's there so the battle because our avatar that's how you get it if you're interested um cb dropped a void for us so i did check out my shadow i didn't check out the void yeah we have four voids so far so that's another update. This is the first void we are getting from that clan boss reward. So it was kind of exciting that I decided to share it. So I've already talked about the Habitat missions. So that's what the Noob to Pro series is up to. If you guys are wondering, yes, I'm still here. Yes, I've not been posting on it because work has been crazy. And um, hopefully you guys are off work and enjoying your Christmas and all, everything like that. I'll be here trying to push my main account to complete the fusion and also slowly progress this noob to pro so we can get all the rewards that we are supposed to be getting from the dragon tournament that is currently going on super with super rates and also whatever that is coming up in the, um, tomorrow's pools make sure you like subscribe so you don't miss that shad pool video you know that's what this channel was built on shard pools free to play shard pools though we don't spend money here because we don't have money to spend on raid all right that's all i have for you guys i'll be in the morning make sure you turn on that post notification you see that video it will be hot because i'm guaranteed a legendary i don't know if we're going to get bad air but i know there's a legendary out of my 60 ancient shard that has to be popping out so plus the noob to pro will have some new epics at least that we will be working with so i'm really really looking forward to that video i'll see you guys tomorrow good night